All right, I'm here with Tyson Stelzer, and um, he's organised this amazing event, which is uh, raising money for the uh, for the Queensland flood uh, flood victims, and uh, the wine industry is involved. And so um, here he is, just going to talk a little bit about how it came about, and um, find out how you might uh, get involved. Tyson, yeah. you want to tell us a little bit about uh, this this raffle, yeah. and um, and and well. First of all, how it started? Yeah, um, it started when I was sitting at home um, in Brisbane in the midst of the floods, thankfully out of, out of reach of the floods myself. Um, but having so many people um, locally who really needed assistance um, financially with, with getting out of this mess, um, but at the same time being a wine writer and having associations and links with wine companies all over Australia and all over the world, I had email after email and phone call after phone call from people saying, are you OK? Is everything all right? Can we do anything to help with this? We want to help out. Um, and after so many of those came through, I thought, well, I'm probably in a good place to be a person who could start to pull in some of these offers of help um, and coordinating that with the people who need this assistance. So um, I copied the idea of a friend who had done a similar raffle in Victoria for the, the bushfires two years ago, and I phoned him up and asked him about the ins and outs of, of the process and what had worked well and, and what would we do differently again, mm. um, and asked if he'd be happy for me to borrow the model, and he said that was fine. So um, I then said about contacting hundreds of wineries throughout Australia and the world, saying, would you like to donate some prizes for a raffle? Um, thinking if we were really lucky, we might get sixty or $70,000 worth on the basis of what I'd seen with similar things before. Three weeks later, we have $240,000 worth of wine donated. It would have been a lot more, but I had to cut it off somewhere because... Um, I, I cut it off on Tuesday because we want to launch tickets tomorrow, Friday, um, and I just needed to get all the lists sorted and printed and the information out there. But um, I had so many offers since. We, we could have got $300,000 worth if we, we just let it go, but you've got to cut it somewhere. Um, so that's now assembled into 200 prize packs, the first of which is valued at $33,000, um, including a $5,000 trip to the Barossa for four, including flights. Um, Virtually every one of the top wines made in Australia in, in various vintages. Magnum bottles, three litre bottles, six litre bottles, um, multiples of six litre bottles. Um, just incredible stuff that you just can't buy. These are specially donated bottles. Um, and the other significant part of the whole process is quite a few vineyards who've donated said in the same email as their donation, they said, look, we've really suffered this vintage. Some have lost their entire vineyards, some have lost their entire vintage of, of the wines this year, and, and many others are just saying we're really doing it tough, but here you go, here's $3,000 worth of our best wines. Um, and that's just absolutely heartwarming that the Australian wine industry is so keen to help, even though they're in the midst of troubles. Um, so all of that's assembled into raffle prizes, which go on sale um, tonight, Thursday night at midnight, um, for a month. Um, we have support partners all over Australia, donations from 300 wineries um, and other companies just really getting behind it. ANZ Bank has said they'll waive the merchant fees on the transaction, so that's just more money of what's being paid. So out of the $30 ticket price, virtually all of that goes to the flood relief because courier companies have donated freight, accountants have donated auditing skills, promotions companies have donated their PR capability to promote the thing. We've donated our time to do it too, so it means that they're, they're, they're not massive overheads as there are sometimes with these things. Mm. Um, so if people go out and buy a ticket for $30, they get a one chance in 40000 to win one of 200 prizes. So effectively, if you, if you buy 200 tickets, you've got a, um, a massive chance of winning a massive prize because we've got a very limited number of tickets. Um, so there's good in incentives for people there, as well as just the fact that it's a chance to help a charity. Yep. So we'll donate toward the Queensland Premier's Appeal and also to the Victorian Flood Relief through the Red Cross after the floods down there. So the funds will go both ways. Um, and you can donate through our website, which is www.winefloodrelief.com.au. Fantastic. And obviously the, the, the feedback and the, uh, and the response from the wine industry has been really positive, not only with the, with the donations but uh, from wineries, but people who um, are involved in the industry, be it um, wine storage facilities, yep. freight transporters, um, yep. everyone's getting on, in, on board to, uh, to do what they can to help out. It's just fantastic to be able to give people a chance to use the things that they do professionally to contribute, because obviously everybody asks money and that's great, we need to give money sometimes, but um, there's a limit as to how much money you can sometimes give and to give people a chance to use your skills as an accountant, a courier, um, a pr promotional winemaker or whatever 
Um, people love to do that. They love to do it. They invest and know that it's yeah. been put to good cause. And this is a way that we've been able to pull together literally 400 different businesses throughout Australia and around the world to do something um, which ultimately we we expect will raise in excess of a million dollars toward those who really need it most. Yeah, it's brilliant. Well, Tyson, on behalf of, you know, the, I guess the from the pundits' perspective and, and everyone involved in the wine industry, thank you for... Uh, putting forward your expertise and your skills you. um, and your ability to uh, to bring all these people together to raise you know such a, a wonderful amount and do something that um, is really meaningful for the uh, for the people that need it so yeah. well done thanks very much thank you